acetylamide acetylamide is used to prevent and reduce the symptoms of altitude sickness this medication can decrease headache tiredness nausea dizziness and shortness of breath that can occur when you climb quickly to high at altitudes uh, generally about uh, 10000 feet uh, 3048 meters it is particularly useful in situations when you cannot make a slow ascent the best way to prevent altitude sickness are climbing slowly stopping for 24 hours during the climbing to allow the body to adjust to the new height and talking it is the first one to two days this medication is also used with other medication to treat high pressure inside the eye due to certain type of glaucoma as it might belong to a class of during known as carbonic anhydrase inhibitors it works by decreasing the production production of fluid inside the eye it is also used to decrease the build up of body fluid caused by heart failure or certain medications acetazolamide can work less well over time so it is usually used only for a short period it has also been used with other medication to treat certain type of seizures how to use acetazolamide if you are taking the tablet take this medication by mouth as directed by your doctor usually one to four times daily if you are taking the long acting capsules take this medication by mouth as directed by your doctor usually one or two times daily follow the long acting capsule rule do not open break or chew the capsule doing so can destroy the long action of the drug and may increase side effect acetylamide may be taken with or without food drink plenty of fluids unless otherwise directed by your doctor the dosage is based on your medical condition and response to treatment to prevent altitude sickness start taking acetylcholamide one to two days before you start to climb continue taking it while you are climbing and for at least 48 hours after you have reached your final altitude you may need to continue taking this medication while say staying at the high altitude to control your symptoms if you develop severe altitude sickness it is important that you climb down as quickly as possible acetylcholamide will not protect you from the serious effect of severe altitude sickness if you are taking this drug for another condition such as glaucoma seizures use this medication regularly as directed to get the most benefit from it to help you remember take it at the same time each day taking your last dose in the early evening will help prevent you from having a get up in the middle of the night to urinate consult your doctor or pharmacist if you have question about your dosing schedule do not increase your dose so use this drug more often or for longer than prescribed your condition will not improve any faster and your risk of side effect will increase when used for an extend period this medication may not work as well and may require different doing do, dosing your doctor will be monitoring your condition tell your doctor if your condition does not improve or if it worsen this drug may reduce the potassium levels in your blood your doctor may recommend that you eat food rich in potassium while you are taking this medication your doctor may also prescribe a potassium supplement for you to take during treatment consult your doctor for more information tell your doctor if your condition last or gets worse side effect dizziness slight redness or increased urination may occur especially during the first few days as your body adjusts to the medication blurred vision dry mouth drowsiness loss of appetite nausea vomiting diarrhea or change in taste may also occur if any of these effect last to get rose tell your doctor or pharmacist promptly 
to reduce the risk of dizziness and lightheadedness get up slowly when rising from a sitting or lying position remember that this medication has been prescribed because your doctor has judged that the benefit to you is greater than the risk of side effect many people using this medication do not have serious side effect tell your doctor right away if you have any serious side effect including tingling of the hands feet hearing loss ringing in the ears unusual tiredness easy bleeding bruising fast irregular heartbeat muscle cramp pain new or worsen eye pain decrease in vision mental mood change such as confusion difficulty concentrating things of liver disease such as nausea vomiting that doesn't stop stomach abdominal pain yellow in eyes skin dark urine signs of kidney problems such as painful urination pink bloody urine change if in the amount of urine sign of infection such as sore throat that doesn't go away fever chills a very serious allergic reaction to this drug is rare how will you get medical help right away if you notice any symptoms of a serious allergic reaction including rash itching swelling especially of the face tongue throat severe dizziness trouble breathing this is not a complete list of possible side effect if you notice other effect not list above contact your doctor or pharmacist precautions before taking acetazolamide tell your doctor or pharmacist if you are allergic to it or if you have any other allergies the product may contain inactivity ingredients which can cause allergic reaction or other problems talk to your doctor or pharmacist for more details before using this medication tell your doctor or pharmacist to a medical history especially of adrenal gland problem such as adeno addison's disease untreated mineral imbalance such as low sodium potassium hypochloromic acidosis dehydration kidney disease liver disease breathing problems such as chronic obstructive pulmonary disease copd empyema lung infection diabetics gout narrow angle glaucoma overactive thyroid hyperthyroidism while the medication can help you get used to high altitude can help you tolerate quick climb it cannot completely prevent seriously altitude sickness symptoms of serious altitude sickness may include severe shortness of breath mental mood change such as confusion difficulty concentrating lack of coordination struggling work extreme tiredness severe headache if you develop any of these symptoms it is very important that you descend to a lower altitude as co- uh, quickly as possible to prevent seriously possible fatal problems this drug may make you a dizzy or drowsy or blur vis- uh, your vision alcohol or marijuana can make you a more dizzy or drowsy do not drive use machinery or do anything that needs alertness so clear vision until you can do it safely limit alcoholic beverage talk to your doctor if you are using marijuana this drug may really make your blood sugar rise uh, which can cause so rusen diabetes tell your doctor right away if you have symptoms of high blood sugar such as increased thirst urination if you already have diabetes check your blood sugar regularly as directed then share the result with your doctor this medication may also lower your blood sugar symptoms of low blood sugar include sudden sweating shaking fast heartbeat hunger blurred vision dizziness or tingling hand feet it is a good habit to carry glucose tablet or gel to treat low blood sugar if you don't have these reliable forms of glucose rapidly raise your blood sugar by eating a quick source of sugar such as table sugar honey or candy or by drinking a glass of orange juice so not non diet soda tell your doctor right away about the reaction and the use of this product to help prevent low blood sugar eat meals on a regular schedule and do not skip meals 
this medication may make you uh, more sensitive to the sun limit to a time in the sun avoid tanning boats and sun lamps use sunscreen and wear protective clothing in outdoors tell your doctor right away if you get sunburn or have sun blisters redness before having surgery tell your doctor or so dentist about all the product you use including prescription drug non prescription drug and herbal products other adults may be more sensitivity to its effective especially dizziness and lightheadedness during pregnancy this medication should be used only when clearly needed discuss the risk and benefit with your doctor this medication passed into breast milk but is unlikely to harm a nursing infant consult your doctor before breastfeeding interactions drug interaction may change how your medication work or increase your risk for serious side effect this document does not contain all possible drug interactions keep a list of all the product you use and share it with your doctor and pharmacist do not start stop or change the dosage of any medicines without your doctor's approval some product that may interact with this drug include lithium memantine methanamine or listat certain drug used to treat seizures topiramate sonisamide check the labels on all your medicine because they may contain aspirin or aspirin like drugs salicylate which can cause serious side effect if taken in large doses with the medication however if your doctor has directed you to take low dose aspirin for heart attack or stroke prevention you should continue taking it unless your doctor interacts and you otherwise you otherwise ask your doctor or pharmacist for more details some products have ingredients that could loosen your swelling tell your pharmacist what product you are using and ask how to use them safely this medication may, may interfere with certain lab test possibly cause false test result make sure lab personnel and all your doctors know you use this drug overdose if someone has overdose and has serious symptoms such as passing out or trouble breathing call 911 otherwise call the poison control center right away notes do not change brands so dosage form of this medication without consulting your doctor or pharmacist not all from this medication work the same way do not share this medication with others lab and no medical test such as complete blood count potassium and sodium levels in the blood liver function test may be done while you are using this medication keep all medicine and lab appointments consult your doctor for more details miss dose if you miss a dose take it as soon as you remember if it is near the time for your next dose skip the medical dose take your next dose at the regular time do not double the dose to catch up storage if to at room temperature away from light and moisture do not store in the bathroom keep all medicine away from children and pets do not flush medicine down the toilet or pour them into a drain unless instruct to do so properly discard this product when it is expired or no longer needed consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company